Amnesty International is accusing some of the world's best-known hotel booking and travel companies of supporting illegal settlement expansion in the occupied West Bank and East Jerusalem. It says Airbnb, Booking.com, Expedia and TripAdvisor are fueling human rights violations against Palestinians by listing hotels and activities in Israeli settlements. Airbnb had 300 listings, TripAdvisor 70, Booking.com 45 and Expedia 9. After an investigation by Al Jazeera and Human Rights Watch in November, Airbnb said it would remove the listings in settlements in the occupied West Bank, but not occupied East Jerusalem. Amnesty says many listings aren't honest about where the hotels are, such as one hotel in the Kafar Adamim settlement. Booking.com says it's 25 kilometers from the Dead Sea with panoramic views of the Yehuda Desert, but the website doesn't say it's in an illegal Israeli settlement. Well, the Bedouin village of Khan al is less than two kilometers away. Israel's Supreme Court gave the green light for the eviction of all villagers in September. Israel has offered them two places to move to, one beside a former rubbish dump near Abu Dis and the other an old sewage plant near Jericho. Well, Amnesty International says it's time for these companies to stand up for human rights by withdrawing all of their listings in illegal settlements.